Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. You know, there's always an old saying, assumption can be your worst enemy, especially when you assume things that may not be true or accurate. And this is just one case of where assumption went wrong. What turned out to be a nice gesture turned out to be insulting, racist, and stereotypical of black people. Now, in case you guys don't know, uh, Amazon Warehouse in Chicago, why am I not surprised, decided to celebrate Juneteenth by basically ordering chicken and waffles for their black employees as some kind of celebration. And basically, the employees looked at the management at Amazon as in, are you kidding me? At the end of the day, don't assume that every black person like chicken and waffles. I mean, it's, it came as a nice gesture, but at the same time, it was offensive and it was racist. That's like, you know, if you run, run into a Mexican employee and you say, hey, hey, Salvador, you know, I'm hungry. Are you hungry? And then he says, yeah. And then you say, hey, man, let's go to a Mexican restaurant. That could be stereotypical. You just can't assume. Or if you see a dude that's aging and say, hey, Mr. Wong, uh, you hungry? I'm hungry. All right, let's go get some Chinese food. But, you know, this is the thing that they this is how they see us. At the end of the day, you could have said, hey, what type of food would you like? Instead of just assuming that every brother was going to be like, all right, chicken and waffles. And they was going to start high fiving each other. So let this be a lesson. And don't come here talking that dang. Some people is ungrateful and you being too emotional. No, it's called being disrespected. Why don't you ask somebody what they want to eat before you just assume that's what they want to eat? But this is a lesson learned. I'm not going to go too hard in on Amazon. You know, at the end of the day, that was just a stupid error that they made. You know, and it happened in Chicago. And I'm pretty sure, you know, if, uh, you know, the balls find out, the big balls find out, they'll be in deep shit. But, you know, it is what it is, you know. This your boy Town Biz. I'm out.